Hello there, I'm Acid, and welcome back to Let's Play Medieval. We're gonna get to this enchanted earth this time around, and we are going to, uh... Kick some frog butt. Because screw those frogs, I still don't like them. Even though it's only been one episode ago. Still didn't change. Trust me. Don't... Actually, do they come back later if I... whatever. Just gonna kill him and get it over with. There. Take care of these. Okay. Take care of this weird plant. Get more frogs. Can we stop? Thank you. Take care of that. Okay. So. If. I can kill these frogs. If I remember correctly, we need to go up this, uh, whatcha who's it? The, um, no, oh, what, what the heck, why can't I think of the thing, the things that, like, go up mountains, you know, the, uh, I, I'm drawing a blank, I don't know why. <laughs> Pretty sure everybody knows what I'm talking about. Those like cable cars or cable car, is that what it is? Uh, maybe there's another name for it, I'm not remembering, but like the cable cars for skiing and stuff like that to get top of mountains. That's what I'm thinking of. So us referencing these as uh, we follow these bad boys up. And I believe there's uh, an eagle nest up here, which we might see. And also there's these weird mushroom growths or something like that. I don't know why I'm bothering with those guys. Screw them. And the, these weird growths kind of look like watermelon. That's what I always think of when I see them. Turn camera. Yep, here's the nest. Oh. Okay, so the goal... The goal... Oh my goodness. Is to knock the eggs out of the nest. I know, so rude. Dang it. Of course, the last. Break it! Come on! Why are they so hard to roll? The last one is the important one. That has the earth room. Oh, bull! Okay, so now we. Okay. <laughs> that was dumb. What I was gonna say was, uh, let's head back down, but I had headed back down a little bit, uh, quicker than I should have. I think you can just jump from here, but I'm just gonna wait a little bit. Don't go back up. Okay. Oh, that wasn't a lot. All right. So now that we have the earth rune, we need to not go this way. That's a dead end. Here's where the boss is. Can't go in there yet because uh, that's why. You need a thingy. Uh, where? I think the earth rune is this way. Yep. The earth rune hand. Oh, you stupid frog. Ah! Frogs! Why? Freaking... Stop. Just stop. No. I guess the plant will leave me alone. <laughs> He's like, oh, wait, you're gonna talk to him. I'll, I'll give you a second. <laughs> Separated from the world of goodness and light until the earth cracks open. No one, not even the Dark Lord Zarek, can release them without the Shadow Artifact. I just notice how they spelled Artifact. Or share their doom. I think an old timey way of doing it. Oh, now the plant's like, get him now. Ugh, look at that weird door. So yeah, we use the weird hand thing. Open the gate. And go inside. Why, you ask? Huh. <laughs> Is 
Sir Dan, you must take the Shadow Demon Talisman. It is an unholy relic that may allow you to progress through Shadow Demon territory. Who wrote that? Yeah, who wrote that? Um. Fire. Water. Earth. Or was the other one Earth? Wind. Oh, by the way, we just released the demons. <laughs> yep. That whole time, everybody was like, I don't want the demons released. And we go and release them. Pretty heroic, huh? Yeah, Chalice is there. Wait, what was in the other one? Was that just gold? Oh, that's, that's the exit. That's important. I don't think this guy's gonna be too happy of what we've just done. What have you done? Once again, the shadow demons are wreaking havoc across the land, and it's all thanks to you. You're welcome. The single most destructive and wretched creatures in the history of the world, and you've given them an early parole. They will be heading for the ruins of King Peregrine's castle. Galamir is doomed. Don't worry about it. I can take you, these guys. They're really tough, though. I can't wait till I get my next sword. That'll be a lot better. Okay, so that's just the star rune. We can't leave that way yet. I wish I could see where I'm going. Double teaming is not fair. Stop it. Stop it, stop it. Don't run away either. I'm not letting any of you live. Uh, hey. What the world? Is that a freaking plant shooting me? Oh, hey. There we go. Fall up again, enchant the sword for a time being. I really wish I could see where I'm going. Why is the camera being so annoying? There we go. Kill that thing really quick. There we go. I mean, essentially, you have to, like, run around the areas to, uh, to, um, find, uh, wait, wasn't there more up there? Now I feel like I left too early. There's more up there, isn't there? Something, or maybe I'm thinking of something else. Maybe that's later. Oh. Ugh. I'm searching for the uh, shadow demons. Uh oh. There aren't any over here. Well, we're just going to take the short way back. Or the safer way back, I should say. I guess we do have to fight the demons now? Or whatever the heck they are? Uh, it's another double boss. Uh like the guardians and they're like flying creatures so you definitely need um you definitely need uh friggin ranged weapons or not ranged weapons or whatever arrows and shit okay please let's not fail i don't have that much health <laughs> That's another problem, too, that freaking uh, platform decides to play dirty. 
This is actually going not too badly. Oh, shit. What does that mean again? Oh, yeah. There's one. See, flame arrows. Ball and arrows, yeah. Because they give the extra damage. Well, also, the damage you get, or they get when you hit them. Oh, well, that was... That was not too bad, actually. I think that was one of the easiest, uh... Easiest fights I've ever had. Uh, when it comes to those guys. Switch to sword. And, oh, you know what's stupid? If you fall <laughs> off of here, I th it I think actually that's like tree leaves, so I think it's you falling, like all the way down. But when you actually do fall, you just like, I just kind of like lay there, and it's like, I fell four feet. It's a little more than four feet, but still, it's like it wouldn't kill me. And how generous two life fountains. So yeah, don't fall, you'll die. It sucks. We're full. And there's that area. Now we have the, the creatures. And the chalice can be collected too. Alrighty, that's not the right way. So we just go... Uh, this way. Let's see, it's chalice right here. Boom. All right. I hope I get my sword. I don't yet, do I? Dang it. I guess we'll have to see. Screw it. <laughs> I don't need that. I don't need to deal with those dudes. <laughs> they don't exist for all I care. I'm surprised that this guy doesn't have anything to say for uh, releasing the shadow demons. Probably everybody was like, what have you done? <laughs> That'd be funny. Okay, so let's see. Nope, no sword for me. Talk to him. I don't know why I'm not dashing. No, I guess I can only talk to uh, Blood... whatever fucking his name is. Yeah, I'm gonna talk to you like this. Courses for this guy. I bet money you be back pushing all daisies by now. Hey, I have something here for you. You like it very much? You want? I do. I'll screw you for betting against me. I mean, I did technically die, but not totally. Technicalities. Okie dokie. So now we get to go to. To. Which level's next? Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no. It's the pools of the ancient dead. This level, this level, ah, <sighs> this level sucks. <laughs> oh, there's no way else of we're putting it. The muck is so easy to fall into, and then when you fall into it, it's instant death. And I definitely don't want a, uh, a replay of last time. Oh my god. Okay. Because, as you can see, that wasn't very good. Cold and dark and weak in this. 
we would witness an ancient battle fought here between the forces of good and the dark armies of Zarak. Now the marshes are falling into the restless Yay. Weapons are useless against the heavy armor of the knights. Don't let them shove you into the swamp. The mud will never come out. Yep. There are those big, fat armor dudes. And they push you into the thing. But first, let's talk to this dude. It's essentially death. Or the bowman, I guess. <laughs> it is I who ferry lost souls on their final journey to the land of the dead. But oh, have we not met before? Sir Daniel Fortescue, don't you do? Thanks to Zarok's meddling, I'm up to the eye sockets in lost souls who've woken from the eternal sleep. The business has been this brisk since before they invented sanitation. <laughs> Look, if you help me to gather up a boatload of eight lost souls and bring them here, I'll drop you off at the sunken town of Melamine. How's that sound? Sounds pretty good. It's a much better place than this. Alright, so watch, you gotta like... Do that. It's the only way to kill him. These tentacles just... What? What is this? Like, why? Why are there weird tentacles in the muck? Uh, let's see. Can I buy, please? No! Thank you. Okay. So there's also a lot of jumping involved. And that's also what causes issues. There's a flag in my way. Okay. Now, um... I believe this, yeah, is our buddy. Which, sometimes he can push the dudes into the things, sometimes he doesn't. It's kind of weird. Don't hit that skull box, please. That skull box is one of those explodey things. And you do not want to activate those here. I beg your pardon? It's plugged in. What the heck is that about? All you're doing is making noise, dude. You need to help out more. Oh. And uh, as you collect the souls, the bridge platforms disappear. So that's why there's a lot of jumping involved, because your platforms you walk across go bye-bye. And when platforms go bye-bye, that sucks. You're still not dead over here? Come on. And, there's, and then there's these dudes that also come up from the muck that... Hey! Screw off! Ugh. Useless. No. Oh yeah, see this bridge right here? I'm gonna perform a magic trick. Now you see it. Now you don't. <laughs> oh boy. It has begun. <laughs> oh boy. Come on. Why is this one so hard to hit? Take the moment. Okay, now we're good on health. Probably gonna lose more. Oh, that's annoying when they freaking fall in there. So you can't get them. Unless you have the axe. Or something else, but axe is best.
You see what I mean? You, you just slide off the edges. You, you think you're fine, you think you're doing good, and then just... Bleh. Every time. Okay, so there's a thing here. But... No, just, no, I hate... Ugh. I don't want to get that one over there just yet. I think it's really difficult. Mm-hmm. I can't... Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All those things are freaking... All those things are freaking bombs. I don't want to hit them. <laughs> just want to do that. Okay. Now what I'm going to try to do... This might not work. I'm going to try to do... Let's activate it from way over there. And move away so it doesn't hit me without falling into the... I nearly fell in again. Okay. Whew. Okay, enough. No more. Please. Yeah, don't go to the left that way. It, it sucks. Really difficult. What the heck? Okay, there we go. Whew. Okay, I think we can make this jump. I think we can. Not easily. Why? <laughs> Why? I swear. I'm trying to time my jump at the last second. It just... Okay, so we don't game over. Let's quick get our freaking health right away. Now you see why I don't like this level. I guess we're gonna have to... Do we really have to go this way? Ah! I'm pressing circle. Oh my god. Please don't get no. Oh. It's gonna happen again. I'm gonna totally game over. Is there? I shouldn't have gotten rid of that platform yet. I shouldn't have gotten rid of it. I. I. Freaking a. Okay. Okay. <laughs> We're continuing. Oh, please. I need this life so desperately. Please do not fall in. Oh. Oh, and a life bottle. Oh, God. Just get away. Oh. Not game over yet. Thank God. All right. Let's get the thing. Actually, let's kill this dude, quick. Okie dokie, and now... Run like crazy, because these things come after you. Or run semi-quickly. <laughs> Easy peasy. I know, it sucks when you get this. Uh, a bunch of these guys come up. And they're super annoying. Wow, the slowdown. What is happening? <laughs> I, I don't think it's ever been this bad. It's, it's so weird. Oh, well, it is the digital version we're playing right now. And I don't remember if I did before. So I, maybe the CD version does not lag out as bad. Bang, 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 bang. There we go. Alright. Now we can continue. And unfortunately, we still have to deal with uh, the muck. And then we have to find uh, 
Oh, that's right. Oh, we have all the souls, that's why. We have these dudes. These flying fuckers are very annoying. And you have to kill them for a chalice, I believe. Fudge. Stop it. Stop it. Yep, you do. Okay. So you have to, like, run around and find all the remaining dudes. All while trying not to die in the muck. Then you get the chalice and get out of here. Oh, come on. Ready to go. What are they? They look like almost like clowns in suits of armor. Okay. I heard that. Oh, wait. Was that just... Stupid muck. The bubbles, I thought, were uh, somebody coming out of the muck. How dare you trick me. Whoops. I think I need one more, right? There's a dude, like, over there. Um. Oh. That's right, there's a dude up there. There's two of them up there. That might actually be it. Oh, please let that be it. That would be nice. Come on. Where'd the other one go? No, come back! No! That's not fair. Really? Come on, there we go. Hey, okay, jeez. Chalice is over here. Right. Yes, it is. Right there. The Hall of Heroes awaits for your troubles. And we're good. And I almost fall into the freaking thing as I say that. How gracious of you. It's a change to meet a polite young skeleton after dealing with those filthy zombie types. Come aboard. Skeletons are friends, not zombies. Oh, good. Good, good, good. Guess what we get this time? My favorite. Yes. All right, Dan Man, how you doing? <laughs> yeah, it is, he is covered in luck. Mm-mm. to battle against an army of undead without a magic sword. Here, take mine. You'll never have to sharpen another blade, or my name's not Dirk Steadfast. It's not enough just to have a magic shield, you know, no matter what that soft ticky stern card says. <laughs> yes. Good lad. Why, I'd sooner go into battle holding a tea train than carry that weedy girl's shield of his. Weedy girl shield. <laughs> yes, we got the magic sword. Look at how pretty it is. Oh, yes, badass. This puppy can take out a lot of things really easy, and I'm super glad we finally have it. It's it's almost like a, a make up for their uh, for that last level. They're like, hmm, what what should we put after that? Oh, I know. Let's put the best sword in the game after that, so then you don't feel as awful. <laughs> uh, and yep, the next level is pretty nice looking level. I think it's pretty, pretty pretty. I guess one of the better looking levels. This is all the water and whatever. But anyway, the like will be next time because we are out of time for this video. So. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, spike those thumbs up. And I'll see you in the next video.